Good morning, everybody. So, this morning I want to share out a second Timothy. I'm going to read from chapter 4, and I'm going to read verse 18. The Lord will rescue me from every evil deed, and will bring me safely to his heavenly kingdom. To him be the glory forever and ever. Amen. One thing that helps with worry and anxiety, in my opinion, is holding fast with confidence that you know that no matter what you're going through, the Lord will see you through. Jesus is always there with you, no matter what. And yes, it can get bad, it can get ugly, it can get painful, But he will be with you no matter what. And sometimes it's going to be a very hard journey to go through. And the Lord will be there. You got to have faith and confidence in him. And know that he will see you through everything. And if for some reason it is your time to leave this earth and you're a believer, you're going to heaven. You're going to a better place anyways. I mean, he'll bring you home. Because remember, when you're a Christian... And you believe that Jesus Christ, you know, came on the earth by by means of a virgin birth. Because God, you know, impregnated uh, Mary. And he grew up living a, a sinless life. Then he died on that cross willingly for, for our sins, for every man and every woman's sin on this earth. He was buried, he was in a tomb for three days, and then he rose from that grave and walked out of that tomb, defeating death, you know, establishing the fact that there is eternal life through him. And then he ascended back up to heaven, and there he sits right now, just waiting for God to tell him to come get all those who are followers and believers of Christ and of God. So even if you should pass away from whatever you're going through or for whatever evil deeds being to you, if you truly believe, you're going to be brought safely to heaven. I mean, you think about it. If you're gone and you're a believer... There's nothing left to tempt you to sin. You're dead. You know, you're you're physically dead, so you're no longer part of the earth. You now transition into the spiritual realm while you'll where you'll enjoy your internal life. So once you're rid of this mortal housing, tent, apartment, whatever you want to call it. When you're when you're done of this from this physical body from this physical form, and you're a follower of Christ, you're bathed in His blood, washed clean, and being not of the earth anymore, physically. There's nothing that can be done further to you, and there's nothing there that can tempt you anymore. So that's. Through his blood, through the Holy Spirit, that's how he's going to bring you to heaven. Because you said yes, and you accepted the free gift of eternal life. So, keep all this in mind. And try not to let things worry you. Or or cause you to have anxiety. Because no matter what, Jesus is there for you. He'll see you through. 
But if it's your time to go home, if it's your time to camp, to go to heaven, then he will safely draw you out of that mortal body and receive you into heaven. That's all I got for you. Love you guys. Have a blessed day. See you tomorrow.